stand by for your Alaska Aviation link where we're going to see the pilot of this aircraft fly. So this is a Regala wing and we're going to see somebody fly it. Lloyd Hood is going to give us a little demonstration about how to fly a weight shift trike. This aircraft doesn't have a tail. The tail's built into the wing, technically. It's called a weight shift. And you basically, it's a hang glider. It's a powered hang glider. It has a motor on the back. Instead of running and jumping off the mountain, you are able to take off, glide back down, just like a hang glider. We can fly them just about anywhere, summer, winter. We have skis for them. You can put floats on them if you want. They're not built for long flights, but they're a recreational vehicle. I carry it in a, at a car trailer, assemble it within about an hour and I'm able to take off in about 250 feet. We adhere to all the safety regulations as far as flight rules go and try to maintain a, a relationship with all the other aircraft pilots. This aircraft, they all come with several different kinds of air engines, but this is a Rotex, it's got about 52 horsepower, twin carb, twin cylinder, dual ignition. It's running a three blade propeller, a carbon fiber propeller. This is a French machine. And in Europe, they require them to be very, very quiet. So it has little added features, as exhaust intake and a slow turning prop. Well, I've got just about 300 hours flying it. Depends on the weather. Like I said, it's a fair weather machine. We want to be safe when I go up. So some years I get a lot of flying in, some years I don't get so much in. But I enjoy it every time I go up. And it's a, a very fun, exciting way to spend an afternoon. My most memorable flight was I took off from Birchwood in April on skis and I flew to Trapper Creek, spent the night and flew back the next day. I flew probably, I think it was over six and a half hours airtime, landing at the lakes, talking to people, flying all the way back to Birchwood. It was a beautiful sunny spring day and it don't get any better. A fellow flyer and I decided to make a trip. We flew from Willow area and we flew to Telkeetna to the Hudson Memorial Fly-In about two years ago. Anyway, we, we were the only ultralight, light sport, weight shift trikes there, but there was a lot of other very, very lightweight aircraft. Anyway, we entered a contest. It was a, a slow, a fast, and uh, the aircraft that had the, the greatest differential. Anyway, I was very fortunate enough to be able to fly they clocked you ground speed now. Ground speed's different than airspeed, but I was clocked at 15 miles an hour across the runway on a sunny afternoon. A lot slower than I normally fly because this aircraft usually touches the ground around about 22 miles an hour. So uh, I had a little thermal help, Mother Nature. All right, so we've seen Lloyd fly here at Birchwood Airport. We've got a good demonstration of this machine, a weight shift trike. Air Creation. I'm Rob Stapleton for Your Alaska Aviation Link.